What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the Macro Crunch YouTube channel. It's been a while since I've done a proper video over on here. It's been a lot of shorts and advent calendar videos and whatnot uh, every day in December up until Christmas. Hope you have all had a fantastic Christmas and a happy new year to you as well. In this video, it is actually going to be the part two of the advent calendar review that I did earlier on in the month. So if you've been following along with the shorts or you follow us over on the Instagram account, you will have seen what I got every single day in this advent calendar and a lot of different things. I've got some of them here with me as well. And these are a few of the most noteworthy items that we got. For example, the shaker bottle, we got some multivitamin gummies, uh, we've got the peanut butter pouch and we've got this uh, recovery ball as well. Now, in this video, I'm going to be going over whether I think it was worth it, whether I think it was uh, you know, a good product to get, especially because it was quite expensive and in these sorts of things you don't know what you're going to get. It's a little bit of a gamble, but overall I'm just going to give my thoughts and how I felt towards it. Again, this is just my opinion. First and foremost, overall, do I think it was worth it? Absolutely yes. And not just for the money aspect of it. Obviously, this was priced at $74.99. I was lucky and got in a, a discount code or like they ran a promotion where it was just under £50, I believe. Uh, so I got this for that much, uh, which made it a little bit more affordable and kind of makes it so that all of the products inside definitely were worth more than I paid for it. It does still work out cheaper to buy this than to buy everything individually, even if you pay the $74.99, especially with big things like the recovery ball, the, the shaker and the, uh, the vitamin gummies and stuff. Things like that, which are a little bit more expensive than just like the protein bars are going to make it worth it monetary wise. More than that, personally, I believe it was worth it for the chance to try new products. For example, a lot of the things in here I personally wouldn't buy, even down to like, I definitely wouldn't have bought a recovery ball, gummies, a peanut butter pouch, and a lot of the different bars and stuff you got every day. I've bought a lot of those things and the opportunity to try all of this new stuff was really good. Especially some of the things like the, the different bars. I would never typically buy vegan bars. I would never typically buy uh, different flavors that I, wouldn't necessarily expect to like. I usually take the safe bets and choose flavors that I know I'm going to enjoy. And some of the other bits as well. So overall, if you look at it that way, it's an opportunity to try new things and kind of step out of your comfort zone unknowingly. And you're going to get a ton of new products that you're going to be able to try. And then maybe you might even find a new favorite, which is perfect. So another thing worth mentioning quite quickly and randomly is you do actually get this box, which is definitely reusable. Yes, it says advent calendar on the front, not too big of an issue, but inside you do have the three drawers as well, which you can use for storing the items you get. You could put this in the corner of like your home gym or you know where you keep all your other nutrition stuff and just use it as a storage unit and it's super useful for that. So that in itself is quite worth it. It's not worth $74.99, but it's definitely worth something. So that's super cool that you get this with it and it is reusable, it's not just like a flimsy normal advent calendar. Yeah, overall, I think it was a super good product that they've brought out this year. I've also heard from both comments in videos, messages over on the Instagram account and just people who I know in the sort of fitness world as well, I guess, um, that they release one of these every single year. I know there's no point buying this one now, you can't buy this one now for this year, but the whole point of this review is that next year when they bring out the next one, you may see what you get in this and think, actually, yeah, I'm going to try that out. I want to I want to get in on that. And it's actually a good idea if you do, because I looked through reviews of the 2019, the 2020, and obviously now I have the 2021 edition. And every year, year on year, people are saying it's just getting better and better. And the price is increasing a little bit, but every year you're getting much better stuff. So, so I would definitely recommend thinking about getting next year's one because you're going to get a ton of cool stuff and chances are it's going to be better than this year, which was already amazing. Well, that's it for this video, guys. I hope this has helped you kind of inform a decision on whether or not you want to maybe get something like this next year. And potentially, I'm going to do some more reviews on the individual products and just sort of go through what was great, what wasn't so great, and you know, what I would recommend you buying and trying for yourselves. Let me know, leave a comment, leave a like, it all works. Uh, just to let me know that you guys want to see some more of these sort of reviews. And I'll definitely do them because I really enjoy making the videos and 
I just want to sort of let you guys know what's worth buying what what isn't. So, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to follow us over on the Instagram account. It is at Macro Crunch. It'll be down here at the bottom somewhere. Subscribe to the YouTube channel so you never miss a video. There's going to be a lot of big things coming up in 2022. And I hope you all had a fantastic Christmas. Let us know what you did for it in the comments below. I'm super excited to hear about it. And have a fantastic New Year's, however you choose to celebrate it. Stay safe, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.